Deb Levitz and welcome back to another adventure with me, Fallen Angel. How is everyone doing today? <clears throat> I might sound a little worse, but I'm doing good. I hope all y'all are doing good. But let's just head straight into our game. Hello everyone, we are continuing our newest game. Emily's True Love. I think this is a platinum edition, I think. And we just started this, so we're on our part two of this. So let's just head into it. It says, I'm getting married. Are Emily's tears a sign of joy or an old wound reopening? Let's find out. Day four, I'm getting married. So, did you manage to get any braiding done last night? Um, oh, yeah, it was just some romantic sci-fi uh, mystery novel. Boring, really. Really? Because that sounds fantastic. What is it called? The book, uh, uh, Mystery of the Shirtless Astronaut. Wouldn't recommend it. You can't fool me, Emily. Let me see that. Give me back my love letter. <laughs> Tablet. No, because it's charging. Love letter. I'll give this back after you share all the juicy details with me. <laughs> First of all, you're so mean. Yes. Okay. That's a good bit, looks like. This. All the fixings. He just takes off with our letter. It's like cheesecake. Looks good. I love cheesecake. My fiance is actually making us some lasagna, so I'm like starving. Which I'm hungry, hungry. Fresh fries, that sounds good too. Let's try to get some plain mouse. There we go, little man. Get this and this for little old lady. You want a newspaper with everything. Bye guys. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, I'm asleep. I have a headache all day. I've had a headache every day. All day. And it is killing me. And I don't want it no more. <laughs> But yeah, uh, later I met, I mean, sometime early in the month or whatever, my husband ordered me some things off my Amazon wish, and I am going to unbox them with all of y'all to show y'all what he got me. And then after that, that's what I might start putting my address, my address, so my mailing address, so 
y'all can start sending me stuff through the mail. This may be to give y'all an idea of what I like. <laughs> and what my little boy likes and stuff like that. Which he's a boy, he's into a lot of things right now. He's into a lot of old movies. Like the Tom and Jerry's and old Looney Tunes movies and stuff like that. It's really hard to find those. You can only find them like every now and again, but that's what I've been doing. And he likes Scooby Doo, the old Scooby Doo's and stuff like that. So, no. Yeah, we've been looking for a lot of that kind of stuff. <coughs> Child is weird. Give us back the letter. Give me back. Give me my letter back, please. Okay, okay. At least tell me who it's from. John Paul. John Paul? Your summer love in France? That John Paul? Yes. His mother didn't approve of him having an American girlfriend. I thought that's why he never wrote me back. Turns out he did write me back. After all, he wants us to be together, or at least he did. Oh my gosh, Emily, you have to go to Paris. This is a sign. A wedding in Paris? Oh, how romantic. Francois, this letter has been sent 16 years ago. We'd be strangers by now. What kind of person marries someone they barely know? Uh-oh. Hey, everyone, guess what? I'm getting married. <laughs> Is Emily's sister really getting married? More importantly, to who? Oh no. The dressed code. Y'all gonna hear my munchkin. He's home from his daddy's. The dress the beast. Good morning, Emily. Hi, Patrick. Um, I know this is the last minute, but a customer of mine gave me two tickets to the Sundance Festival. I would love to, Patrick, but I can't. Fine. I know someone else who does want to go. Angel's having her wedding that day. Oh, too bad. I mean, for you, not for her. Uh, never mind. <laughs> Maybe next time? Sure. That would be, like, next year. <laughs> From food. <laughs> Daydreaming again. So, Emily, I was thinking we could add a few things to the breakfast menu. Mmm, whatever you say, Francois. Like French toast, French croissants, maybe some French onion soup? Mmm, sure, whatever. That sounds very funny, Francois. Emily, Paris is your destiny. How many chances does anyone get a, get at true love? First of all, my life is here. I just can't move to Paris because of some old letter. <laughs> He's like, fine, I'll take this in the back. <laughs> Throw it away. <laughs> She's right. She can't up and leave over an old letter. I mean... <laughs> Paris, friends would be nice, but come on. <laughs> you want everything. You want just lettuce, tomato, and this, and cheesecake. Thank you for choosing something that doesn't take me long so I can get a combo. Yes. This, and I'll do this, this, and this. Thank you. 
I see where the mouse is gonna pop up. Mommy. Woody. My tablet on. Not yet. <laughs> Mom, are we ready to go dress shopping? Are you kidding? I've been waiting for this my entire life. Finally, one of my daughters are getting married. Emily, I told Jimmy he, you take extra good care of him. He's a big eater. Uh, I heard you were a good cook. How about a little free sample? I'm starving. Don't worry, I'll help out in the meantime. Out. Now. You are alright. Loud butt. Yes, Dad, help me. Jimmy, I swear to God. Jimmy! Why do you need two newspapers? Tell me. I know, kid. I'm sorry. I guess your cooking's all right. Nothing to write home, write home about, but not too bad. Are you kidding me? Uh, all the ungrateful. <laughs> nice try, Francois, but I'm still not going to Paris. <laughs> He's so cute. Nice trying <laughs> to get her to go. <laughs> Uh, I don't like mimes, they're worse than clowns. Uh, about the same as clowns, I think, to me. I don't like clowns, I don't like mimes. Uh, all creepy. <laughs> I don't even like watching clown movies. The only clown movie I watch is it. It's because that's old. I haven't even watched the new one. The chapter two the new one. I watched the first one. I just haven't made it to the second one yet because that's how badly my fear of clowns is. And it's been like that since I've been a kid. So it kind of takes me a while to watch anything that has to do with a clown movie. Especially like the It movie. It's going to take me a while to get my courage up to watch it because I try to watch it. And like my brain, like no. Go clean, Dad. Do my dirty work, so I don't got everything here. This, this, this. 
and our stuff is closed. Go. Get out. Find that. There, there, Angela. It'll be all right. Nothing ever works out for me. Ever. What's wrong? Jimmy, my one true love, I couldn't find a wedding dress anywhere. We have to postpone. Ah, uh, Buttercup. I know a tailor. Trust me. He's gonna hook us up. Forget about it. I knew you'd think of something, Snoop Moons. Ugh. <laughs> Isn't he wonderful? Think you're lucky. Will Jimmy find Angela a wedding dress in time? I hope not. Day six, the dress display. Still, I know that's me, but I can't help it. Do you remember how the comments colors of the sunset we wrote as one? Stop dreaming over that letter, Emily. Uh, I can't see anything. I'm hoarding a bunch of letters that my fiance has wrote to me ever since we got together. So. <laughs> Morning, Francois. What are you? What are you up to? Just helping out, out with Angela. Just helping out with the cleaning for Angela's reception. Ah, uh, that's very kind of you. What? <laughs> Jimmy thought it would be a nice gesture of you to throw them a reception. I thought he knew a guy who could cut them a deal. Well, apparently you're the guy. Uh, really? Oh, it's mine. Like, I can't. But it's creepy as I say, no. First of all, why do you have to be something that I don't like? Like, I can't help it. I, mm, I don't like it. <laughs> mm -mm. Not for me. Mm -hmm. This, 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 and here, and here, and double. Hello, little Ustidi. You want a newspaper, you want a bread, tomato, and all. I can do that. A cookie and some tea. I can do. I was looking where you'd pop up. Bread, lettuce, tomato. Give it. I've got a note, newspaper in here, and go here, and go mom clean. There you go. I love how her dad's just sitting there in the chair just reading the Oh look, her face isn't in the newspaper. That's pretty cool. This to this. And I'll grab that newspaper when that's good time. Got some new paper right there beside y'all. Makes it easy for me. And we'll do that. We can go. My phone just made a weird noise. Pepper, this rice, and cookie. Can we go? Clean. Check out Emily. There you go. I am coming. Can 
Clean mom. So once I check them out, they can just get out of here. Good thing I'll move, so I need to worry about losing hearts and stuff. What? No, you can wait a little bit longer. Uh -uh, put my hat back. Sexton. Buggy. Took off of my, one of my hats. He's in one of his moods because his tablet is dead, and I won't let him have it until it's charged. Because he destroyed his other tablet, and we had to get him another one because he kept he messed up the battery in it. Like he kept plugging it, unplugging it, plugging it, everything with the charger. Mm -mm. So I took it from I take it from him, let it charge, and so he take gets. A break from screen time. Clean. I said, get it. No, where's your sippy cup that I gave you? Gosh, the wedding dress has arrived. It's hideous. It's white. Emily, Prince Ball, it's it's very sweet of Jimmy too. Oh my gosh, it is hideous. Not to mention that's that it's way too big for her. We can't let Angela see her dress like this. She'll be crushed. Not a word from anyone. Next time, will Angela's, will Angela's wedding be postponed? But I guess y'all have to wait and see what happens. And, oh my god, that wedding dress. Uh -uh. I, I wouldn't wear that if someone paid me to wear it. So hopefully you're all liking this video. If you do, get a thumbs up and comment down below which one of the Emily's are you excited for and what do you think is going to happen. And if you've seen it, no spoilers for everyone else. I know everyone's probably already seen the game, but still. And if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button and earn them wings and become one of my beloveds. And hit that bell icon so you know when I post videos every single day. But I'll see y'all in the next video. Much love, my angels. Bye, guys.